real smoke players here. Maybe two. And if Bride goes down, well, you know okay, that's the diffuser the gone with it. Shaiko now going to have to pick that up. You need Renchiro coming in. He's towards Trophy Window. He needs to try and stop Quibs from trying to get back into sight, but Jaylad has it all to do. He has to try and deny. No C4, no nothing to deny the plan going down, Ollie. And it's going to be a very difficult retake for Falcon. Jaylad doesn't even get a chance. Doesn't get a look in against Shaiko. And as you know, Quibs, he's just going to be held by Renchi. Doesn't even need He has to do something about this one dimensional push. Two players still above inside of Solar. O kills and quibs. O kills in a bit of a, an all centric position. It will catch out Shaiko. Drone work not good enough from BDS. Yeah. And there's quibs. Eliminates the lambs. Renshiro in the middle between both of them as that DMR tries to spray through the wall. The shotgun pistol comes out from O kills. Drops to his belly. Where they should come in here, but no, he gets shot down by the bailiff. Renji has to pick up the remains, but he's all out of time. Falcons a million times better than what we've seen previously alternate way of dealing with that player inside of stock you can go a number of different ways about that whether you want to try and maybe maverick open a hole from the bottom stairs that's always an option that teams can look at Rude, he's gonna go for the drop immediately gets himself into an engagement play for kd at the moment play for rating of which is kd and rating is quite good so far inside of this competition and he's gonna pad it a little bit further there with an exit kill that's all it will ever be Nice idea from BDS. I really like the idea of using the uh, using the candelas to try. And As it, it's kind of got some of it, but not all of it. So I think maybe they've they've done it now to get it all open. But they haven't lost the lambs. Shaiko has actually rotated away to a position. Maybe he honestly, oh, like, he could potentially go for the jump and take the one v one, or even maybe catch Joker. As he's going to go for the revive. Shaiko, this could be brilliant from him. He will find two kills as Joker gets lured into that full sense of security. A refrag will come in for Mo kills on P9 from Brittany. A massive kill for P9. Renshira once again stuck. Quibs. He needs to be careful, Ollie. But Brady doesn't look phased. They're actually trying to hunt for Joker, but they didn't know that Joker's actually impacted him from base, but they think it's a trophy impact. Gonna see kills continue to trade as BDS do manage to stabilize here. They know Joker's offside. Joker. Still going to be out and about, top of West Main stairs right now. Both of them are holding, what do you go plant? Red Eagle plant! They're in a reasonable position here. This is having a lot of fun inside of the corridor there. Green Day and Renshi, they've got a lot to do. Oh, kills, go on, make it the ace. He deserves it if he gets it. He's only got Renshi left to find. He's in the hot seat here, 25, 35 seconds left on the clock. He's going to try and go for it, but Renshi, the spoil sport, puts an end to that reign of terror. Does have the diffuser. There's a couple of kills to find though. Isn't going to be an easy clutch by any means here for Red Cheese. Location well and truly known. He's going to be getting peaked. But Falcons. I keep referring to the little. He's done his job. Look at the time. 28 seconds left on the clock. He got himself a kill as They're well. One trench. They're going we are main going wall. to be able to open up that main wall, but it, it isn't as ideal as opening up that trench wall. And don't forget, we've still got Shaiko on the flank ready to rejoin his teammates. C4 now going to get tossed out. 13 seconds left. Quibs does have the diffuser in hand. Could just go for a bit of a plant on the table, but that requires cover of Flashed blue. And that's not something that they've got at the minute. The kills for BDS come thick and fast. One by one. Nailer. Yeah, there's just a whole... And just going for a little bit of a battle there. No kills. He knows that's that mirror window there. And he's going to get gifted a Lems. A Lems is just going and putting his face into a... It's a bit of a problem there. The mirror window though, Wally, that's what it's all about. As long as that's standing, they can definitely get potential here to end this round. Fenrir will deploy those fear gadgets and it does create some issues for Falcon Shaiko now in the one versus three. Has to try and stop the diffuser. All of them almost line up. Pistol comes in, but no! Doesn't. Because the lens has come and saved him. Oh, there's just been more people than Falcon. He's jumping at that opportunity. And oh, now he Shaiko. dies to a random nade. So unlucky. Up against the castle barricade. The nade goes in, but a good refrag from Renshi. But then he himself will get taken down. As Falcons, they are desperately trying to get into the bomb site, Ollie. BDS are positioned away outside towards lobby. I think there's a player above it. Will be Efac, and he's going to have to try and stop this defuse going down. And he will do so, Ollie. Who he didn't want to shoot too late. Time to perfection. A lever to Jalad as he tries to move in towards blue. That's what I'm talking about. As long as that wall is shut, the blue player becomes a big old issue. No kills. He's 14 and 6 all the after nine rounds.
going to need to get a heck of a lot more if he wants to win this round. And well, that's a good start. Eliminates EFAC, but down goes the Diffuser. It's going to be called an O-Kills. Has to move through the site and has to find two of them. One is going to be tucked in the pillar now. All of a sudden, a 1v1 pistol comes in. Oh, that was very, very close. O-Kill. No idea how he's pulled it off. It's no wonder he's on a sliver of HP. Quibs, Joker. We go for a rotation upstairs with 20 seconds left to go. It's not really where you want to be. Joker finds one onto Renshi. The Diffuser is not going to be in the hands of either of these two attackers. And well, the clock is likely going to do the rest here. Joker does get himself into sight. Gets a great shot there onto Elems. But ultimately left sprinting. Second kill now comes in for BDS. Falcons still not in position to respond. This is like the round that BDS have. Falcons have lost two players and they haven't even entered the building. Yeah. You know, it's... It's the reverse of round one. Mm -hmm. And only because the teams are on opposite sides. Oh, it's just going to keep on coming now, isn't it? JLAD's got mm -hmm. himself into the site. Doesn't matter. He's going to likely find himself a quick engagement here. Maybe gets a good couple of points of damage in, but he's on his own. Where's Three the days down. What's he going to do from here? Where's the diffuser? Where's the kick? We seem to do a map for BDS. It's one that they, they'll love to play. They'll go for against Joker. And yeah, the shield. How has this not been taken out? Ollie, there's, there's neither the Lion or the Dogby run a gone six. Wrench seems more interested in trying to confirm the kill at this point. Oh. And Lems has just been gifted Fade a shot away. through the wall. Domes, J-Lad, all he's trying to do is open a line of sight there. Joker, working with a line of sight of his own, is able to take down Renshi. The deployable shield was such a big issue for a long time, but we've gone past that now into the two versus two. Look at him go! Cook the nade, he knows that someone's down at the end of the corridor. Will go for it, will get spot out. P9 does dodge the nade and... Oh no, Efac, look where he's crossed into all the into sight. That grenade has caused the distraction. Alem's actually finishes off Quibs P9 with his own DMR, Oli. So many DMRs in this game. Seen a lot of DMRs. Problem is, P9's gonna have to make his work overtime here to keep up and to keep his team in it. Grab himself, and all of a sudden, it all just comes together. Because obviously, Alem's, he knows this, he's going for the nades. If Alem's does die, Efac will be there for, there for the refrag. Exactly. Because they know where Efac is, and the pockets of space that he makes. Better to but... throw your nades before you go for the challenge. Shaiko's making sure we don't forget about him. He gets his first kill. Hey, Shaiko, how are you doing today? Go Round number three for you to get your first. That's not always too normal. P9 left in the clutches here. BDS, they have torn this defense. He's likely not going to be given the space to get the plant down. Does get a... <laughs> A little bit of a peek there. The player has just hopped up the drone since being shot. He now knows that they're on a slightly elevated angle. Might not be a bad idea to try and bait the plant down. He's going to go for that and just see if he can force any sort of reaction out of Falcons here. But there's only so many times you can play that trick. He knows that there's a player at the top of those house stairs as well. So he's got fantastic info. He knows everything at the moment. He's just going to try and navigate this to push himself through and see if he can find anything. Lamb's also brought the impact EMP drives just in case they need him this time around. No calls left, no lion scans left, Ollie, but still two nades in the back pocket of Shaikh. We haven't used them yet. Renshi will find one onto Quibs. It's just a time game now, really. You've got a couple of drones left on the side of BDS. They need to gather that info. Oh, kills. Well, we know where he is. Alem sees to that. Could potentially look to try and push up through now. We can see a drone at Joker's feet as we've seen Shaiko's name in the top right of the kill feed. He's now trapped. He's not getting out of there alive. Shaiko knows there's a player there at the top of those black stairs. I'm going to see Bride push down aggressively and start to harass on the Monty. Just giving Shaiko enough room to thread some She's bullets by the fun. side. Five versus two now. Joker surely not going to go for a little bit of a hop out here of Geisha. Thinks better of it. He's hiding out currently inside of Geisha. Doesn't really have the ability to move it. Well, Quibs, he's stuck behind goal. This is going to be a flawless round demo if ever I've seen oh, it. The moment. They've got the mirror window, Ollie, which they have to go through. They've just shot off the ace charges straight off the wall. ADS there is going to save Plus one, but Joker us. is going to take out Renshiro. That could be a peak that seriously costs them here. Oh my goodness, you have a shield, Alams, and you're not playing behind it. He gets eliminated also, and now BDS. I thought they were in great shape. Plenty of utility to play off. But hey, he goes down. Efac has to do it all. We'll get one, but the Diffuser surely will be planted by Quibs. That's all he needs to try and prioritize. There is a C4 from below. So Efac, is he going to get surely. lucky? There's a ping. There's a ping. Oh, he pop oh, what a drop. Diffuser is being planted. He's going left. He's going right. He doesn't know where to go. He has to try and win the engagement against P9. Quibs has came off the plant. He's going to go back onto it now.
Leaky Fat could try and stop this plant and keep himself alive. He's got a bit of information here, but he needs to land his shots. He's missed out on the one versus one due to the player plants, and it's now a firm 2v1 in favor of Falcons. Drone at his feet, gonna give the info away. He's gonna have to hit some good shots here to get away with this one. A P9 isn't good. If that shield's gonna cause them issues, P9 maybe looking if he could just wander in. Not too sure that main stairs is being held by Alliance, but a good double pinch as Joker comes up the stairway. Had great refrag though, Brida again with a pistol. We'll find one and so many kills come in, but it's Shaiko in top two inside of karaoke. will do him nicely, P9. He knows where he is. He's trying to get the angle, but he cannot find it. And through the wall, Renshiro fires a flurry of bullets. And O kills, well, he was the man outside of Black Balcony trying to get in, but he was all that's left. And Shaikwin said, I think they missed out on a lot of opportunities to really... This is for a spot in the grand finals. Does he know where the final player is coming from? The indicator there, the tracer rounds coming through the wall. It's going to tell him all he needs to know. He's got a ping on the oh diffuser as well. He can drop off. He's playing a C4 from below. Look at the time left demo. They have so Just many 20 cameras. seconds left on the clock, and everybody on the side of BDS is on a cam. That more than likely means that there is a cam in sight, and if there is a cam in sight, there's a very good chance that Breede can deny this plant from below. You can see him there lurking. The C4 goes up. Yes. Shaiko, everybody talks about leaky fact. Alems 